beautiful love. On the 10th of May 2023, the Round Britain Cruise RBC 60 came to Plymouth and we were there to record it. Hello, what's your name? I'm Mike Beckett. And what's your boat called? Boat, the boat's called Benita. Benita? Yes. And you're one of the organisers of the event, aren't you? Well, I, I'm part of the National Air GA. The, 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 the event has been organised by um, Old Gaffers locally. Right. The association locally in the, the South West, a thriving organisation. And what's so I'm here as a visitor. So what's the story about the Old Gaffers on the 60th anniversary? The Old Gaffers, oh, it's 60. It was formed 60 years ago because people felt that there was a need for um, a revival of interest in traditional rig, which had been neglected and in some ways be very successful. Um, because more and more new boats are being built and old boats are being restored. Yeah. Um, that was 60 years ago, and to celebrate this, we're having a, uh, a, a voyage around Britain. Right. Because the Old Gaffers Association is, consists of local organisations in various places. So there's a branch here in the southwest. Yeah. East, you know, East Coast, etc., etc. So travelling around Britain is a logical way to, um, you know, tie all these areas up. And you've had some interesting weather to start with, haven't you? What? You've had some interesting weather to start with. We've had some. We had some fairly bad weather in the Channel, yes. And how long? How long will it take to uh, to it's get around? Three months. Have? Three months. That's quite a lot. Yes. It is quite long. Uh, it's, it's, it's a fairly leisurely cruise, and you have to allow for the weather. I mean, you can go around Britain in much less time than that, obviously. Yes. Uh, but there are stop-offs in various places. Like, you know, we were in the had a dinner with the local people here last night, and yeah, you went to one of the the new pier. Yeah. Um, yes. Yes. The hotel yes. on the on uh, Mayflower. Uh, no. Mayf near Mayflower Steps, where the no, Pilgrim Mayflower Fathers Steps, yes, set yes, out the, from. Yes, yeah. yes, the local organisation had arranged something. So, so what's the story day. behind your boat? Benita. Benita was built in 1888. Yes. Uh, as a yacht um, in Morecambe Bay, uh, right. where where, uh, where they built fishing boats, uh, yeah. Morecambe Bay prawners, um, and. Uh, she was originally a racing boat, but after about 20 years, as these things happened, she uh, was no longer competitive, so she was turned into a cruising boat. Yeah. And um, my father, before the war, uh, 1937, was looking for uh, a, a bigger boat, and he couldn't afford much. And the best he could afford was this 50-year-old boat that was uh, seen to be seen to be still in reasonable nick. Exactly. So you inherited her. So, so she, now she's mine. Yes. I mean, we, 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 I've inherited her some years ago. And so the, she's been in the family for a long time. And where's the furthest you've sailed with her? Uh, where's well, the well, we've been, We went around Britain ten years ago. Yes. We sailed quite a lot mm. in the Channel and North Sea. We went to the Baltic in her about well, five years ago. Yeah. Uh, so she's, she's a reasonable amount of use. But some years, of course, she just potters around with, you know, the Thames Estuary. And other years, we try and do a bit more with her. Yeah. Well, good luck with your trip anyway. What? Good luck with your trip anyway. Thank you very much. Yes. Well, thank you. We're anxious about the wind crossing Bristol Channel. Really. <laughs> Hoping for fair winds. Yeah, we're getting very un uh, unusual weather, aren't we? We're getting very unusual weather, yes. I think it's part of climate change. Yeah. They used to say you blew south southwesterly three days out of four, but that's not true anymore. Yeah. You've had lots of walls there and easterly winds. Oh. Well, it, well, it increases the adventure anyway, so... Uh, it increases the difficulty of planning. I mean, yes. with an old boat, you, you, you can't bash along in bad weather the way you can in a, in a, in a you know, modern steel boat or something like that. So yeah. You have, to, you have to treat the old girl gently. So what's the maintenance... to do. Sorry, what's the maintenance on her? Uh, it's mostly done by me. Yes. So it keeps you busy all the time then? <laughs> it's, 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 it's some, but I mean, all boats have maintenance if you use them, you know. Yes. The engine, mast, gear, sails, etc. are much the same on any boat. Yeah. Um, yeah. Right, thanks very much anyway. Okay. Special thanks to BBC Radio Cornwall, Plymouth Gin, Sutton Harbour Holdings, Jonathan Bryce, the Plymouth organiser, and everyone involved in the Round Britain Cruise RBC 60. 2023. 30 years of culture and the arts as a free service on Love Summertime TV. Don't forget to friendly share my videos, subscribe to my channel and support me through PayPal at ccsphoto1 at gmail.com. Thanks for watching the video.